After a two-year absence, the Gulf Open of Senegal made a comeback for the 14th edition over the weekend. The mixed competition brought together 98 professional and amateur players from Senegal, Gambia and Sierra Leone. CGTN's Mohamed Abubakar has more. This year's Golf Open of Senegal was held on two golf courses, King Fahad Palace Hotel in Dakar and the Sali Golf Course, a seaside town located 70 kilometers from the Senegalese capital. During the six-day event, golfers repeated on two different 9- and 18-hole circuits. At the end of the competition, Senegalese golfer Papi Sambanyang took first place. Second place also went to a Senegalese female golfer, Omi Dia, followed in third by Gambian Sidi Kasama. It was a week of hard work. I arrived on the eve of the tournament, but I managed to maintain my pace. I pushed myself to the limit and achieved my goals, and I'm very happy. My opponents, I know them. We often play together. The conditions were not easy, but I had to be quite careful and very calculating in the course. My ambitions are the same. I want to reach the highest summit of world golf, and I work very hard every day to get there. This is the first time that I've played at the Golf Open of Senegal as a professional, and I'm very satisfied with my performance. It's also the first time I'm playing with the men on the same start. It was a bit difficult, but I held on. I have noticed that there are few women in golf, so this tournament was an opportunity for me to show that golf is not just for men. It was a good week, though, you know, it was tough starting from, say, um, Meridian coming down to Sally. You know, it was a long, long journey. But all in all, it was a good tournament. You know, hopefully next year they will make it big. You know, we pray that they have a, you know, more sponsors coming in because you can see golf is coming big in Senegal. You know, and the federation they're doing good. You know, I think they just need a support from the government, as you know, other countries that did as they do it. This international mixed golf tournament, held every two years in Senegal, has 27 professional golfers and 71 amateurs. This is the 14th edition of the international golf tournament that we organized. The challenge of golf in Senegal is primarily infrastructure, but also the promotion of the sport. So, we organize local tournaments to expose young people to the sport. We have also signed partnerships with schools to teach this sport in schools. This time the level is good compared to previous years. The challenge of Senegalese golf is to develop and popularize it in all regions of the country. This is our ambition and we're getting there. The Golf Open of Senegal, which is the 14th edition, is an opportunity for golfers to reconnect with the sport after two years without international competition. Mohamed Abubakar, CGTN.